Okay, to get started, I'm in the Edit tab where I've added a video clip to my timeline. First, let's say you want to delete something in the middle of your clip by cutting it out. To do this, move the playhead to where you want to start cutting out the unwanted part of your clip. Then press the C key on your keyboard to make the cut. Next, move the playhead to where you want to finish cutting out your clip, and once more, press the C key to make another cut. Okay, now that we cut out part of our clip, simply select it and press the delete key on your keyboard to get rid of it. Deleting my clip left a gap here, so I'd have to drag my clips back together. Doing it this way works okay, but I'm going to undo this to show you how to skip dragging them back together. This time, with your clip selected, press the X key on your keyboard, which will not only delete your clip, but keep your other clips together. Alright, that's it for cutting, so next let's talk about trimming clips. To trim off the end of the last clip on your timeline, simply hover over the end of your clip so you see a bracket. Then drag its end to the left to trim off however much you want to get rid of. To trim off the beginning of the first clip on your timeline, hover over the beginning of your clip, but this time you'll need to hold down the control key while dragging your clip to the right. To remove the gap, right click it and select close gap. Next, let's say you want to trim off the end of a clip right before the cut. To do this, position your cursor over the end of the clip so you only see a single bracket. Then drag it to the left. To trim off the beginning of a clip after the cut, position your cursor over the beginning of your clip so you only see a single bracket. Then drag it to the left. Keep in mind that you can also hold down the control key while doing this if you'd like to trim your clips without shifting them back together automatically. Finally, you might be wondering what happens if I drag the cut when there are two brackets. This will trim your clip while overwriting it with the previous one. Alright, and that's it for this tutorial, so thanks for watching, and see you next time.